Hey guys, it's Kalina and today I'm going to put some blue hair paint wax on my hair. And so I used the Camille Rose Gel. I tried some of the hair paint wax on this little section here just to give it a test out. So let's get started. So this is the blue hair paint wax. So I initially put this on my hair. My hair was really wet. You can see there's like a hint of blue. but I think it was too wet. I thought it was too wet. So um, I sat up under the hooded hair dryer and I let my hair dry a little bit. And I liked it a little bit, a little bit better this way because um, the blue stuck to my hair a little bit better and my hair was super vibrant. And so uh, this is me putting the blue, the blue on and this is what it's looking like and I like how it's applying. So one thing you gotta be careful about, you don't want your hair to be super wet because to me like the color isn't as vibrant or it, it'll like slide off, but you don't want your hair to be too dry because if you've already put your styler on, you'll kind of make your curls frizzy. So you have to have that right balance between the two. So I just go ahead and put this all over my head. Um, at first I wasn't even for sure if I wanted to like proceed putting the blue everywhere because my hair was looking a little bit frizzy, but um, eventually I go ahead and I put it all over my hair. So to me the best way to apply it is just to rub it all over your hands like I was just showing you there and then just apply it just kind of like I'm doing here. To me you shouldn't use a big section but just a small like to medium size section and that'll help um, like evenly distribute the color over your hair. I think I got my hair a little bit too dry that's why I was looking a little frizzy but in some places I just added a little bit more water and then I added a little bit more gel and that way my curls will look divine. So you see here like I'm just trying, I'm still like testing it out I'm trying to make sure that I like it and that I want to apply it all over my head and I did find like when I applied it in like little tiny sections like this, my curls um, didn't frizz up no matter how wet or how dry my hair was. But I didn't want to spend all day and night doing this, so I wanted to work in bigger sections, so I made some more wet than the others. One thing you want to be conscious of with this blue is that it is going to get everywhere. I mean, it's going to get <laughs> on your scarf that you're wearing at night, probably your pillowcase, even your towels. I washed one of my white towels and there's still blue in it. I'm sure if I just wash it again and put some bleach on it, it'll come out. But you know, you just need to like kind of be conscious of that. I would be wearing a black or blue to make sure that like, it doesn't mess up, you know, any clothes. One thing that I noticed is that once I added more water and added more gel to my hair and then added even more paint wax to my hair, my hair had a lot of weight. So my hair ended up looking stretched all week, which is really nice. I didn't have to do like any extra stretching or anything. So I am just finishing up the rest of my hair. I only applied the color to the end of my hair, by the way. And I only used about half of the container, maybe a little bit more than half. Okay guys, so I put the color on and I'm loving it. So this is what it looks like. I didn't put it on at first because my hair was super wet. I felt like the color of the paint wax was just sliding off and that's why I wanted to dry my hair a little bit. But I sat up under the hooded dryer and my hair almost dried like instantly. So anyway, I probably should have just sat under there five minutes and then came and put the hair paint wax on. Anyway, this is what it looks like though. I think it, I think it looks good. And let me just tell y'all like, this color is just so, so pretty. I swear, everywhere I went um, for the next week, everybody just loved my hair. I mean, at the grocery store, at church, I was in Sally Beauty one day, and everybody loved, loved my hair. Anyway, I'm gonna go sit up under the hair dryer, and I'll be back. All right, guys, so this is my hair. So I sat up under the hair dryer probably for about 20 minutes. My hair still feels a little damp. I think because I've put so much stuff on my hair. But anyway, I'm not gonna fluff or pick it or anything because I'm about to go to bed. So I'm just gonna put this in a pineapple, put my scarf on and that'd be it. But these are my final results. I'm happy with it. Uh, yeah, so we'll see how it does. We'll see if the color transfers or, you know, how long it lasts. So let me do a final spin.
Hey guys, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.